a diplomat and a statesman. A man who ascended to India's highest executive position in 1997 as a compromise candidate because no political party wanted midterm polls. Inder Kumar Gujral was born in an undivided Punjab in 1919. He jumped into the political fray in college itself. A staunch freedom fighter from the start, Gujral was jailed during the Quit India movement in 1942. Through his career, Gujral was associated with several political parties. First the Communist Party, then the Congress, where his administrative skills were recognized by then Prime Minister Indira Gandhi and he went on to head several ministries. During the infamous emergency in 1975, Gujral was the Information and Broadcasting Minister. In the 1980s, Gujral left Congress to join the Janta Dal. He was made the External Affairs Minister in VP Singh's cabinet. After the 1996 elections, when the United Front government was formed at the centre under H.D. Devigora, Gujral was again made External Affairs Minister and went on to propound the Gujral Doctrine. But in 1997, the Congress withdrew support to the United Front, leading to its collapse. To avoid midterm elections, a compromise was reached. Congress agreed to support the United Front government, but under a new leader. So on the 21st of April 1997, Indar Kumar Gujral was sworn in as India's 12th Prime Minister. As Prime Minister, Gujral had to manage the bitterness between the Congress and his predecessor, Devi Gauda. His term was riddled with controversy. Gujral was criticised for taking no action against former Bihar Chief Minister Lalu Prasad in the Fodder scam case. And his decision to transfer the CBI director who was investigating the case was seen as a move to save Lalu. Another controversial decision of Gujral's government was recommending President's rule in Uttar Pradesh following unruly scenes in the State Assembly. The Congress Party finally withdrew support from Gujral's government in November 1997, forcing him to resign. Since no alternative government could be formed, the only option was midterm elections. I.K. Gujral was in office for all of 11 months, three of them as a caretaker. In 1999, he retired from active politics. Bureau Report, Newsx.